What's up guys, this is a video on how to connect a wireless microphone to the GoPro Hero 5 session. So right, firstly I want to apologise to everybody because I made a video less than a year ago telling everybody how to do this but I couldn't exactly show them because I didn't have all the bits I needed to exactly show everybody how to do it. So right, I've got all the bits now and uh, I can show you that now. So right, firstly I've done a, a video on all these products here so if you need any information or anything it's all on my channel there so right this is the microphone we're going to use and this is the remove you bluetooth microphone for the gopro hero 4 3 plus and 3 but now we can use it with the gopro hero 5 session as well so right i'll show you what that looks like so that's how it comes in the box and this is the m1 receiver And it comes in this waterproof housing so it's um waterproof up to one meter for 30 minutes which means you can use it in rain snow around water in water up to one meter but you've got to remember the bluetooth signal does not work under water so you're not going to have any audio recorded so that's what it looks like in the waterproof housing and i'll take it out to show you what it looks like now So this is what it looks like at the uh, waterproof housing and it's pretty simple actually it's just got a, a indicator light for when you're using it and when it's charging and it's got an on and off switch a pairing button for bluetooth and the side here has got a charging port for charging the built-in battery and it's got this dust cover and a little bit of protection from water as well underneath here we've got a sliding rail so we can attach two types of mounts one mount is a GoPro Hero type mount and the other one is like a clip-on mount and I'll show you them now. So this is what the mounts look like and you've got one clip-on mount, a clip-on mount, sorry, and this will attach to all your clothes or wherever you want to attach it basically. And then you've got another one like this which is a GoPro type mount. So that simply just slides onto the, the back of it and it'll connect to either the waterproof housing or the microphone itself. I'll show you that now. And that just simply attaches onto the back of it like that. The best thing about it is you can rotate it 360 degrees to position it wherever you feel like it's in the best position. So I'll show you this connected to the back of the microphone as well. And that simply attaches onto it like that. So now you can attach it anywhere and get good audio from it. So right, that's the M1 receive, uh, microphone and this is the A1 receiver. And that's what that, the, this looks like and it's basically got an on and off switch here and it's got a Bluetooth pairing button which doubles up as a, a an built-in amplified mode for when you've got it in their waterproof housing so on the side here we've got a charging port and uh, we've got another port here for the audio lead for recording and that's basically all, all it is so this was made like i said to connect to the hero 4 and the hero 3 plus and the 3 but um it simply attaches to the back of it and hooks up on it like a backpack but I'm not going to show you that because the video will get too long but if you if you need more information on how to connect it to the the Hero 4 I've done a video on my channel so go and check that out and uh, I've done a video on how to connect this wireless microphone to a smartphone as well and to the Hero 5 and Hero 6 Black as well so go and check them out so right guys uh, another thing as well the M1 microphone will work up to 30 meters away from the A1 receiver so that's another bonus there so right guys before I forget if you like this video please give it a like and uh, if you haven't already subscribe and leave any comments below so right guys in conjunction with that we will need this Remuyu A1 audio cable which was made for the DSLR cameras with a 3.5 millimeter external microphone jack and I've done a video on my channel with this as well 
with it connected to a camera with the with the demo as well so go and check that out if you want so right what we get in this is you get an a1 audio lead you get a mount for the a1 receiver and you get a cold shoe mount before i forget you do get a a windsock for the microphone as well the only problem i've had with this is it does slip off every now and then you have to keep an eye on it but it's definitely worth investing in a deck dead cat from remove you for the microphone which is miles better so right um that's the a1 cable okay what we'll need in conjunction with that as you know we need the 3.5 uh, millimeter mic adapter which i've got here and finally what we'll need as well is a housing for the GoPro Hero 5 session and I've got this one here so right um, let's put everything together now yeah so right this is the GoPro Hero 5 session so what we're gonna do first of all we're gonna put this into the back of the cam uh, into this case what I bought and uh, we'll slide that in but first thing we'll do is we'll take the door off on the side Slide that into there and close the door. So I'm going to screw it, uh, screw it into the back of here because I've got one of them types of cases. Because I prefer this one because it, when you're moving about, it's not going to rattle. And with the other one, I had a feeling it would rattle, and I didn't want that. So that's the Hero Five session in the case. The next thing we'll need to do is I'm just going to connect this tripod to the bottom of this. But before I do that. I'll uh, turn the Bluetooth microphone on. So that's on now and I'll turn this on and this should automatically pair. So now they're paired and they're ready. So the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna connect this uh, mount to the A1 receiver and we simply hook that into the side here and push down here and that's attached now. We'll get the cold shoe mount and screw that into the back of there. And then we'll connect this on top of the Hero 5 session and tighten that up. So that's attached and ready now. I'm just going to connect this tripod to the bottom of it. So I can show you what's going on. So that's attached now. Just take the lens cap off. So the next thing we need to do is connect the audio lead. So we'll connect the audio lead next to it. That simply connects onto the side there. And then the next thing we're going to need is the dreaded adapter. <laughs> so right, we'll connect that up now. So catch 22 as everybody knows we've got no choice but to use it and then we'll simply connect this into the back of here so that's attached now and uh, it's connected so now we can record audio onto a camera so right guys i'm going to do you a quick demo now and uh give you some audio so right guys um i'm on the bluetooth microphone now and i'll give you a demo so i'm on the bluetooth microphone now and just to show you i'm on the bluetooth microphone you can see it there you should be able to hear that so right um if you don't know already i renovate houses and uh i'm renovating this kitchen at the moment and i've nearly finished it and i'll give you a little look around it So this is the kitchen itself and uh, I've just got to finish the tiling off. Just need to do all the cuts. So right guys, this is your demo. And like I said, I am using the microphone. And you can hear that. So that's your demo guys. So right guys, that's the wireless microphone connected to the Hero 5 session. Make sure you check my other videos out. 
on the Hero 5 and Hero 6 Black as well if you're interested and how I've connected this to a smartphone as well and I've done another video on how to connect it to a Feiyutech SPG gimbal with the wireless microphone with the phone as well and it's absolutely awesome guys you get crystal clear audio with no motor noises or anything so right guys um, thanks again for watching and uh, don't forget to like comment and subscribe for more videos bye